Yo, what is up guys? Today I'm going to show you how you can install any IPA files on iOS. This does not require a computer and it's working on all versions of iOS. So let's go ahead and get right into the tutorial. Now you will notice I'm on an older iPhone, but like I said, it works for any iPhone and any version of iOS. Now the first step you want to do is go ahead and get onto um, the device that you want to install the IPA files. Um, once you're on your device, go ahead and open up settings. We're going to go ahead and click on general, click on background app refresh, and make sure it's set to either Wi-Fi or Wi-Fi and cellular data. Once you have that complete, we're going to go to um, battery right here and go ahead and disable your low power mode. So once you go ahead and disable it, just like that, we should be ready for the download. So I'm going to go back to my home screen, go ahead and open up my internet browser. Um, I'm going to be using Google today, but you can use any web browser. Now what we're going to do is we're going to search for this website right here. It's going to be called injectapp.org. And basically this site um, has a bunch of different apps that you can download. And yeah, I'm going to go ahead and show you which app we're going to be getting today. So go ahead and click on the website. Now once you're on the site, go ahead and wait for it to load. Hit the search bar. And we're going to type in IPA space loader. Now this is a free app, but you're not going to find it on the official app store. So that's why we're going to need to download it through this website. Um, just go ahead and click on it. It's going to go ahead and show you what iPhone you're on and what version you're on. This will just make sure that your device is compatible for the download. Now go ahead and click start injection and it will begin the download process. Now it's super easy. It should only take uh, maybe a minute to download depending on your internet speed. I've already downloaded it um, before I made this video, so I'm going to go ahead and just close out. I don't need to re-download it, but once you do have the IPA loader, you can start installing any IPA files, um, and once you're done with the download, you should see it like appear on your home screen. That's pretty much it. If you guys have any questions, feel free to leave a comment below. Hope you enjoyed this, and until next time, see ya.